another video. Today we're gonna get the truck notch finally. I'm tired of banging frames. It's the roughest ride ever. Good thing I don't have to daily this truck, but finally we're gonna get this motherfucker notch. And then after we're gonna lower it down a little more, but that's gonna be a whole nother video. But for now, we're about to get it set up and go get this thing notch. I can't wait. <sighs> Fucking long, huh? Yeah. That's them four by four U bolts. That's all they had in AutoZone. My flip kit didn't come with U bolts. You couldn't get new ones from Trump? I didn't think about it. I thought about getting the Rough Country ones, but then I had to change how the flip kit is. Hopefully, I get back on the back this week. Uh, that's the bag bracket. Mount the shocks. Plate the inside notch. I think that's it in the back zone. Turn around and get on the front. Wait, this truck run? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna need to put a gas tank in it, yeah. Then I'm gonna try to trade these wheels for the GMC uh, stock 20s like I had and put it on my Yukon. Yeah. Uh, GMC stock 20s that you would get in a setup and get rid of and get a setup and get rid of? Hey, I'll be, be making profit off of everything. Doing now? I put the back oh. It's a seam out of date. So you just got that one little spot. Oh, okay. One step closer. After this one, just drop it by another inch all the way around. Get the HD front end done. Get that bitch one color.
Oh, well, got it all wrapped up. Thanks to my partner Tyler for the notch. Truck ride's 10 times better now. I think my next step is I'm gonna lower it an inch or two all the way around. Getting sitting a little bit lower. Put the back settle down a little more since we notched it since it ain't sitting on the frame anymore. So, we're gonna see how it comes out. But that's it for now. Till next time.